I don't know why I'm back. I don't know why I'm back. Oh, Three, two, 
Come on, come on, come on, we're doing the best I've ever done. This thing selling at least 10 million, for some reason it was discontinued. But there was continual skyrocketing demand for the brilliant idea of stacking two pieces of fried chicken on top of each other with a bit of a serious. Screw it to the doctors who requested to be taken off and just walk back. Some people insane. I just want to beat this. Everybody, you got it. You're doing fantastic. Great job. That's right. Remember this. You did great. Come here in your pride. Problem one. Bye. Good one. Problem two. Great job. That's right. Problem. These things were kind of fun. People in the ads will be doing everything they can to keep silence, but when they try a slice of this pizza, they just have to find a way to yell out, "Wow, what a pizza!" <laughs> they later tried to rebrand it the Inside a Pizza, as technically it was a pizza inside a pizza. But I guess just ordering two pizzas wouldn't be enough. No, no, that would just be silly. But this disaster on a plate didn't sell too well either. So in 2002, it was completely discontinued. By the way, thank you to Mythical Kitchen Channel. I got a better understanding of this. Um, um, 13? Snack, thanks to their video. 10. But why would they create a 10. triple deck of pizza? It just feels like overkill. Well, back in the late 90s, we had this boom of novelty fast food items. Yeah, the I see friends. I hunt people for all eternity. I have lost you. I feel like that. Peace. I guess it really did make his customers go, Wow, what a pizza! Wow, what a pizza! And for seven lucky seven, the hot dog stuffed crust pizza. I remember when the first original stuffed crust pizza got advertised in the 90s. Some nameless guy in the commercial said we had Maybe six. Away. Crust first. The ad gave the impression this guy was cheating on his wife. And it's a deal? Yes, we eat our pizza the wrong way. Crust first. I don't know the guy's name, but fortunately, this is just a TV ad. Hopefully in reality, he went on to treat women nicely and be an honest, decent human being. Huh. Oh, please, every president since Washington has done this. Anyway, after the success of the cheese stuff crust, Pizza Hut started trying to stuff everything but the kitchen sink inside their crusts. Meat pies, mac and cheese, cheesy beef, you name it. But perhaps inevitably, they eventually stumbled upon the hot dog stuffed crust pizza. And personally, I think this looks like a lot of truly six. But apparently it was first sold in Britain and South Korea. But in 2015, it finally reached the States. It just feels very authentically American to me to combine pizza and hot dogs into one item. It's basically just sausage cobbled in the crust of a large pizza. And I may make fun of the excess, but admittedly, I still remember first trying cheese stuffed crust pizza in the 90s. It was freaking incredible. Sure, I wouldn't subject my guts to it nowadays, but as a kid, it was amazing. The hot dog pizza got tons of media attention and reviews, so there was certainly no lack of publicity. The Sun, in fact, claimed it to be the stuff of dreams. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. The magazine claimed it to be a calorific coma. And in this case, I'd say I agree with both assessments. But how do these pizzas actually taste? Well, I found a writer on The Guardian who described it like this. In their words, it was a hot sausage. It tasted rubbery, processed, salty, and smoky. Smoky? As in like smoked meat? Anyway, the sauce... Why are we so close? ...and sweet. The cheese was ungreasy and smooth. And of course, fucking playtime and... Education and learning. Oh, hi. I can't handle it. I can't handle it. I can't. I can't. 
do it. I can't. You can't even hear it. You can hear this and the video that I'm watching in the background so I don't go insane. Fine, we'll do one more. Time for everybody's favorite subject. Math. Math. Good one. Problem two. Great job. You're doing fantastic. You did great. Come here and get your prize. A shiny quarter. Problem one. Good one. Great job. Looks like it's sweeping time! Gotta sweep, sweep, sweep! Don't you dare come down this hallway! Gotta sweep, sweep, sweep! Oh, well, I know where the last two notebooks are.
Got this one, and then I got the one at the end of the hallway. Right there, four, five. Come on, come on, come on. Gotta sweep, sweep, sweep. Congratulations! You found all seven notebooks! Now all you need to do is... Now all you still can! <laughs> of course. He was right there, of course. Of course. Welcome to Bali's basics in education and Of course! That he was just standing in one fucking spot. I don't even care anymore. I'm gonna count that as a victory. Hey, I'm done with this game. I've never been able to beat it. Never. Ever. I've gotten to six. I've gotten to seven notebooks so many times. Yet something always goes wrong. I give up. I'm going to count that as a win in my book. I'm going to count that as a win.